Hey, are you okay? We lost uh, you there for a second. Your nose. I'm okay. Uh, jet lag. High altitude. Oh, that's not good. Am I gonna die in this episode? Oh, you left the ringer off, idiot. Oh, come on. Please answer. Max, holy shit, man, your vision. It's, it's true. You, you saw the tornado, it's coming. What? Oh, no. Chloe, where are you? I'm so fucking scared. I'm, I'm by the beach. I'm, Chloe, I'm can you hear me? Hello? Hello? Oh, my God. The tornado was real. Oh, I didn't fix shit. Chloe will die. Arcadia Bay is going to be destroyed. There has to be a way to stop this. For good. I fully expect this to somehow die. I mean, somehow, the, somehow end with Max dying one way or another. Uh, yeah, I was a little surprised why we were doing an art show. It's, it seemed a little too clean. I'm like, yeah, we got the killer, but... Remember that horrible tornado? With all the weird weather effects? Like... No fucking way. Chloe can't die again. I have to save her. Seems obvious to me. We're gonna go to my selfie and we're gonna rewind back to where that photo was, right? How do these galleries afford to rent here? This makes me feel so sad. Then, I'm probably, back in then I'll probably get knocked right out. Bad picture. Oh, this is gonna take such a toll on her. Jumping back this far. Again. What am I going to fix for my dorm? Oh shit! Oh my head! What is going on now? It feels like reality is breaking apart. What am I doing to time? Those are the dark spots that we saw in the dark room. So that must sim that probably symbolizes the brain the damage. The timeline was so perfect. I'll accept that I need to be in Arcadia Bay, not San Francisco. I just have to make one simple change so I won't end up in San Francisco. Simple. Just don't win the contest. Sorry, San Francisco. Chloe comes first. Here again? I thought I fixed everything. What did you say, Max? What? Jefferson should be in jail, not here. Jesus. It's like you're back in my class. You're still spacing out. It might be cool if you took one of your patented selfies now. The transformation between the old Max and the new Max. Anyway, answer my question, please. How did we... How did we get stuck all the way back here? Not winning the contest is involved in you... In us getting caught? What did we mess up? Fuck you. Good answer. Good answer. Hey. Your nose is bleeding. Probably gave you too big a dose. Sorry about that, Max. But considering you're about to die, a nosebleed is a first world problem. I had to let Victoria Chase go. You let her? Don't be stupid, okay? She's exactly where she deserves to be. No. Oh, as if you care.
So we've changed nothing so far. Your iris, that dilation like a shudder. The pictures you're taking of me now. Too bad you pissed away your gift. You could have won the contest, but you destroyed your own beautiful photograph. What a waste. Sorry, I burned all your stuff. I got a little carried away. Fuck. He burned my diary. Always. That's why I'm still here. Especially since you've developed from nerd to hero within a week. There's something... weird going on with you. Whoa. Did you see how crazy it is outside? Like I said, something weird. There's that fear. Oh, Max, it's an honor working with you on these final sessions. I hope these images will be appreciated for what they truly capture. The loss of youth. <laughs> At least, that's the last lecture you'll ever have to hear from me. And I promise you, no more nosebleeds. Mr. Jefferson, please, don't do this. You don't know what's happening. Shh, 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 shh. Quiet. Quiet, Max. Your brand of crazy is not going to amount to much if this whole place gets destroyed. Please, don't do this. Ironically enough, this might be the only place safe from the storm. I promise, this final dose won't hurt. Is there something I can this do? This final dose won't hurt. There's something I can do. <laughs> At least. Oh, there's nothing to do? Uh. We gotta look around the room. At least. It's all a cutscene though, which means you can't even get a ra you can't even navigate it very well. I can't un I can't stop it here. Yeah, it goes right there. There's I promise. This final dose. There's nothing hurt. interactive around here. What? Oh. David. Fuck him up, David. No, David, no. Jesus. David Madsen. He's out cold. Good. I always hated that fascist fuck. Everybody at Blackwell did, right, Max? Okay. <laughs> Gotta warn him, come on. Max, we can go further back than that, can't we? We have to... Oh, there we go. Right trigger. I was waiting for the skip ahead mo moment. We gotta warn him. Shout something. I promise. This final dose won't hurt. What? David, watch out! Time to shut the fuck up, okay? Holy shit. Bad timing, Max. Too early. Okay. That escalated quickly. David, watch out! How? How did you know that? <sighs> Jesus. <sighs> David Madsen. He's out cold. Good. David, come on, man. I warned you. That means don't that means don't get hit. No more nosebleeds. Wait, hold on. Can I... Can I please ask you for one last... request? Oh... You got me, Max. How can I deny that face? 
Oh, you're a genius. We're stalling him. Oh. If we tell him to go play some music, then he'll walk to the other side of the room, away from the door. He'll have his back to the door, and he'll turn on the stereo. Could he please at least play some music so I can drift away? Even at the end, you're still a dreamer, Max. That's a nice trait. That's perfect. And he won't hear he won't hear David coming. But what stops him from from injecting me? Hold it! What? Ah, well, there's a new. That's a new problem. He's still on me. Can I shout? Can I make some noise or something? The music doesn't seem to have helped. Alright. Here we go. So that was my mistake. I wasn't running for far enough back. Although I did repeat that one segment enough times to actually break it. One last picture. Try to escape. Would you... Uh, take one last picture of me. I I want to be your best subject. I almost don't believe that, but I think you've finally learned from me. Will that keep him busy long enough? a little bit more of a delay. Will he be just slow enough to not be injecting me in time? I promise. This final dose won't hurt. David, 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 David. What? Uh-oh. Here we go again. David, watch out! How? How did you know that? Nope, David still sucks. Alright. What was our other option? Welcome to Time Travel Puzzles with Life is Strange. Little more. Slows down a lot over here. Kinda wish there were kinda wish there was a skip backwards button. Um turn off the lights. Is that gonna help though? I feel like it just gives make it so tar so David can't see. And would you mind turning off the lights? They make me squint, so I won't look good for the shot. Now you're thinking like a real photographer. And I don't want your last memory to be bad lighting. That seemed pointless to me. I don't think that's going to help much. I promise. This final dose won't hurt. What? Yep, exact same scenario. Can the water help me? What if none of these dialogue options help me? Miss you. What if I'm a meat bark? What if this is all a red herring? All right, some water. Uh, excuse me, but my, my throat is scratchy. Can I please have some water? Of course. I don't want you to be uncomfortable. Oh, he moved the cart. And this takes a long time. Is the cart going to be in the way in the way now? Can I kick the cart? My leg's free. Was that a painting of like some of the? This final dose won't hurt. David. What? Kick it! Kick it! Kick it! David, watch out! Time to shut the fuck up, okay? Yep. That didn't help me. I can't knock this thing over. What's the point of moving the card over? It seemed important to me. David, watch out! How? How did you know that? Damn it, David. No gun. 
No balls. Jefferson, it's over. You are not going to stop me. David Manson. Of course. Well, this is what you get for playing cop. A real bullet. Well, that's not good. But now I can warn him, right? I can tell him that there's a gun. That was really weird watching him get up and back. You are not going to stop me. Uh oh. Well, that, he didn't do that much better Sorry, there. Madsen. You should. Something that isn't a bottle, then. He's got to maybe he can grab something else. Not going to stop me. A bottle. The gun down there on the ground, right? Can I tell him to grab that? I have to go further back, probably. What? Going to stop? Grab your gun now. Got it. Oh Christ, David! All right. Well, this is gross. Watching him die over and over again. You are not going to stop. David, kick that table. Yes, sir. <clears throat> David Madsen. I always hated that mustache. You hated him too, Max. Oh, the table actually felt clever. What can we do with the wire? D Jefferson, it's over. Distraction. Oh Lord, Max. Are you okay? Are you alright? Can you move? Yes. Thank you, David. Thank you. Don't thank me. You brought me here. Let's wrap up this son of a bitch first. We need to find a photo. He won't be going anywhere when he wakes up. Except you are going to prison forever. Or worse. Mr. Jefferson? Now it's your turn to be captured in a moment. Save Chloe. He burned everything, including all of my photos. Warren, yes, I, I can use that picture he took of us. Shit, no signal. So now we need to get in touch with Warren. So he can Thanks, get Mr. Jefferson, but you won't need this anymore. So in, in this timeline, we've lost... The Prescott's everyone? had to know about this. I better go outside and call Warren. Oh, please answer. Yeah, Warren's practically the only other character that's alive at this point. Every other classmate that's noteworthy besides the tiny bit characters are all dead. I can I still no feel those straps. This Stop, Max. You're free. David Madsen is on the case. He's still looking for evidence. David? Are you okay? Look at this place. It feels like hell. Jefferson was... was going to kill me. Like he did to Victoria Chase. Oh, no. I always suspected that son of a bitch. I never did. Until too late. You shouldn't have to suspect your teacher. He wasn't a real teacher. He just wanted to lecture. It was part of his sick plans. I wasn't surprised when you accused Nathan of drugging Kate Marsh. I thought so too. And Max, I'll never forgive myself for what happened to Kate. I feel like I helped push her off that roof. So does she. Kate was bullied up to that roof, but it was still Nathan and Jefferson who put her there. I knew Nathan Prescott was a threat. I just waited too long to neutralize him. Jefferson already did. They had some weird father-son thing going on. But Nathan killed Rachel, and Jefferson had to use him as a scapegoat. That pervert was pulling all this shit right under my nose, too. I could have stopped him and Nathan if only... I wasn't so stupid. No. I told Principal Wells Nathan had a gun and almost used it. But he didn't want to believe me. 
I should have been more loud. We all make decisions we regret. But I have to admit, I'm impressed by you. And Chloe. And your investigation. I had all the high-tech toys while you had each other. We... we are a great team. That's one of my problems. I'm not good at teamwork. Never was. Even in the service. I can't even imagine what you went through. I'm not gonna make any excuses for my behavior. I tried to be a good soldier, but... I wasn't so great. I tried to be a good father, too, but... When Joyce kicked me out... I had nothing. I was pissed off and wanted to rage. Yeah. I know the feeling. Too much. I'm going to tell Joyce I was wrong about you. She does love you. It's pretty obvious. I try not to use my service as an excuse, but... It's hard to come home after war. Most people don't know or care what it's like. Except Joyce. She gave me hope. A new life. And you saved mine. Chloe, is she... She would be proud of you. I just want to see her safe with her mother. I promised Joyce I would go see a family counselor. And I'll start by apologizing to Chloe. I don't expect her to call me dad, but... Maybe she'll stop calling me Step Douche. So, where is Chloe? Ah. Uh, can we tell him all the truth? Tell him about Chloe and tell him about my power and why we need to find a photo of me, of me from the past so that we can just get her back? David. Uh, Chloe is... is... dead. This isn't happening. You can't... No, God. Not Chloe. Max, are you... are you sure? Are you... Yes, I... I saw her. I... I saw a... Jefferson Killer in the junkyard. Last night. Last night? When I was feeling sorry for myself in my hotel room? I promised Joyce that I would protect her and Chloe. How can I face her and explain this? I never even told Chloe that I... I God damn it! Max, tell him how we can fix this. Come on. You killed my wife's child, you sick fucker! And you took away my stepdaughter! David, wait! Max... I'm sorry. I'm sorry you had to see that. What a mess. What have I done? All that time I wasted with surveillance. Uh, Chloe. I'm sorry. Joyce. I failed you. My family. You didn't fail. You did your best. Max. You better get outside. You've seen enough of this room. David. Thank you. For saving me.
Why can't I just wake up? Let this be a nightmare. Jefferson is dead now. But I can still bring Chloe back to life. God damn it, Max. When I say tell the truth, you tell all the truth. You gotta commit to the things I tell you to do. Otherwise, that happens. And Chloe's stepfather becomes technically a murderer. Especially since now that the, that guy's tied up, we're probably gonna be pretty aware that they're probably gonna get actually a conviction for killing him executioner style. Now, what the hell is this place? Which is why we gotta fix things a bit. Well, let's explore a little bit before. Jefferson had plenty of women who would have totally posed for him. But he didn't want to give his subjects a choice. That's the really fucked up thing about this is like he could have just oh asked people. It's a but no, he, it had he had he had to know that everyone was fucked up. He had to know that people were there against their will. Looks like Jefferson was planning a major security renovation with Prescott Cash. No one would have looked for Nathan's body with this. Oh, uh, when we take it to LA. So they would think that they would think he'd be gone. Nobody will look at Jefferson's work the same. Max, I'm sorry you had to be here. Oh, Chloe. I'm gonna save you. For the last time. You should probably grab that before he sees it. The There's no way I'm leaving your necklace here. That might give away the fact that he is dead and lead to him freaking out anyway if we don't grab that and he like wanders over here. You won't be going, Jefferson. To any more shows. I was hoping that we could turn him into a sidekick and we'd go on adventures together and try to save everyone. Sorry you had to be here. But uh, Max didn't give him a solution. Frank isn't a bad person, but he can't be in denial about the drugs he provided. And he could be... I, I think Frank could be dead, too. The slight silver lining is he'd be dead, what but he'd also not be able to supply place? Jefferson with drugs anymore. Although at this point, that's a moot point. Just looking at that makes me want to vomit. Damn, Jefferson torched everything. Now the only photo I can get is the one Warren took. It's a studio. Jefferson looks so pathetic now. Like one of his own victims. David, no. You have to press skip a weird number of times. Normally you just press it once. David, um... She was pretty stressed out, so... Um, she went to go... Um, medicate before I ended up in here. So, she's okay. Oh, thank God. For once, I'm happy Chloe's a stoner. <laughs> David, I, I have to go outside and get some real air. And use my phone. Of course. Go on, Max. You're a brave soldier. I'm glad Chloe has a best friend like you. Go on now. You've seen enough of this room. Okay, teacher. Let's see what kind of photo evidence you shit all over this computer. I could have told David the truth. He deserves it. God damn you. I totally called it. If I left the necklace there, he was going to go right over to the computer and he was going to see the necklace and he was going to flip out. And he would have done exactly what happened anyway. There we go. It's a good thing I looked around beforehand. You're fucked, Jefferson. Hopefully he doesn't find any- hopefully Jefferson didn't take a picture of, uh, Chloe's body. 